Hi, I'm Colin Kreitz, and welcome to Ask a Dev. Today's question comes from Kelly, and she wants to know, how can indie game developers best start developing games on Facebook? That's a great question. Before joining Facebook, I was an indie developer myself, so I know firsthand the challenges you can face, especially when going up against much larger game studios. As you know, a lot of what makes indie game development both rewarding and challenging is that you don't have the support of large teams. Luckily, Facebook offers a lot of great resources for smaller developers. My first piece of advice would be to take advantage of the testing opportunities available to you on Facebook. Because it's web-based, your players are always on the most recent version and always connected to the internet, so you're able to get players' telemetry data immediately and test and fix things quickly. And also, you don't have to wait for approval from an app store. You can push a change live, and it's out there. Plus, if you use a cross-platform toolkit, it's easy to ship your successful changes from a web version to mobile. Take advantage of your nimbleness. Ship early, ship often. Second, leverage Facebook's growth and monetization options. It's easy to let marketing fall off your plate when you're spending all your time on development, but our app events allow you to automate a lot of it and get the most from your limited time. For example, if you want to send out an ad to everyone in your community who hasn't played in 14 days, or to people who are like your paying customers but who haven't discovered your game yet, Facebook app events, paired with app insights, makes that incredibly quick and easy. Finally, focus on creating content that interests you. One of the unique things about indie games is that they often cater to intimate, niche communities. Remember, as an indie developer, you are your audience. If you create relevant, engaging content that you value, that'll be valued by your audience. And if you do that consistently, you'll be successful in reaching and retaining players that are gonna love your game. That's it for today's episode. Tweet your questions with hashtag AskADev or leave them in the comments below.